won't work. Well, I could, but I won't. Hello. Hello. Did Conroy give you the order to... Conroy? What are you going to... Oh, I've read all of Conroy's instructions. I also know a good trick that my predecessor taught me. What kind of trick? If a bazillion comes, I'll close my eyes. What exact... It showed talking to a guard. Really? Yeah. Have a good day. I will. Thank you. A phosphos. They give off light and warmth. They don't eat, produce noise, or exhaust fumes. Practical. But they need wind in order to glow. I can't do that. I need to insert a coin. I don't... That's... Well, I could. That could be fun. Won't help. I don't think... Hello. Sweetie. Uh, Miss Barmaid? Why are you staring at the monk? Listen, honey, I knew Conroy personally. I knew the second wind monk, Pander, personally. This is my last chance for the hat trick, so don't bother me now. Do you know anything about the machine at the Wind Fountain Square? Yes, I know of it. I stay away from it, and it stays away from me. Why? How can I explain this to you? Listen, sweetie, at a certain point, you start to turn a blind eye to things. What do you mean? I mean, I did things that you never could imagine. Not even in your wildest dreams. You've probably seen a lot of interesting things. Oh, you bet. I used to do things. Bad things. How bad? Talking about it alone would be reason enough to turn me into stone. That bad? Well, I found them rather amusing. But the bazillions have a different take on the matter. Do I want to know? Believe me, you want to. I can't imagine something that bad. Oh, no? Well, then, let me help you out. He said we were shrouded. And then he went over to me, and then we were took off. But his wife found out about it. Oh, my God. I wouldn't have believed it. And then he said, that dog, that pastor. But his cousin didn't have a clue. That's how I became the head of the book club. 
Oh my god. <laughs> What was your last sin? Oh, funny you're asking about it. So, then he came over, took off my garters. But that's you wouldn't believe. <laughs> and then over there. But there are laws against that. For a reason. So you realize it was immoral. Oh, yes. It was one of the best things I've ever done. Is it a sin if I like a girl, although she's a wanted criminal? Oh, no. Most men love danger. It would be a sin if you... And then over, climb on. But I think she would even like it. I... I think I want to go back to the monastery. Um, I would prefer to talk about something else. What's a garter? Believe me, sweetie. If you get to see one, you're not going to be interested in what it's called. Oh, forget it. You'll figure it out. Figure what out? Maybe you won't. Bye. Take care, sweetie. While we're on this subject, do you have a few asps for my collection? Well, I don't have money, but I'm available for a range of other charitable contributions. Sweetie, I can't distribute what you have to give. You don't have to. I've already done that. What am I supposed to... That's the garbage. What am I... That won't work. Tell me. Okay, well. Realize the weight. Wait a minute. You did what? I had the same look on my face when Ottilie told me her sins. What should I do with all these mints? Leave me alone. I want to be by myself. It seems to be broken and rather distraught. Here, can you use this as a knitting needle? Well, 
I will be able to use it. May I ask where you got it from? From the Sino mat. Interesting. How did you come up with that? Oh, there was this lady behind the bar. Ah, uh, you're talking about Ottilie? She's a babe. I'm afraid you've been imprisoned for far too long. We're still missing something for the onesie. I'm trying my best. could be fun. Well, I can't. That won't. Why should I do that? Now comes the trip. Oh, Malleus. You know a girl like me is like the wind. Here and there. Well, I'm on familiar grounds with wind. What am I supposed to do with This mint has the shape of a coin. Hey, there's no bubble gum in here. These are marbles. Too bad. Marbles don't taste half as good as bubble gum. And... That's just... The marbles are sparkling in the chest. Is it true what they say about you guys? It depends. What do they say? Well, they say that you've never had a woman, and that given the chance, you take practically anything and everything you can get. That's true. 